So, I didn't jailbreak mine. This is a very good printer. Very good printer. I like it. I mean, I like my Dreamer a lot. Um, you know, it's a manual bed level. I had to go around, tighten it chassis tighten up everything i can <laughs> tighten up without taking it apart but this one i did print shims and i did come out with some successful prints like these test cubes this is one this is two uh, they're square Yeah, and I did put a glass bed on here because the, the factory one reflexes. So that's the bottom. That's from a, using a glass bed. But uh, I put a glass. I, I put glass on here and put tape just in case. And my meshing came out pretty good. That's my actual level. I believe that's the tape and any noise, any interference. But it was zero. But before I had, it was like that. Like what I see and learn from all the people on YouTube that received this printer, bought it, or our affiliates or whatever. I just printed out some shims. I did take the bottom of loose tighten up the belts you know put the lock screws in just like you're doing timing on certain vehicles on the motor you know you got the lock pins you got to make sure the one near the door handle which is your right the left you got to make sure all of them don't move you know put the three screws in a couple of people did that and um kind of went their way and i printed out a couple of shims I only had to use two shims one in the back and uh, one on my right near the handle. So if I'm doing this correctly, right to left, and that's the back. I put a thicker one in the back. I don't even remember the size. I just put it on there. And that's what came out. So when this tape wears out that I have on here, when the tape wears out, I'll recalibrate it, redo the bed level, and try it again. I'm printing, I don't even know how long this job is. Let's see. How long is this job? Two hours. So, we'll see. So, I put glue on the tape, too. So, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> but, um, it's, it's, most of my prints came out pretty good anyway. Out the box. But the, the fact that you know, you got to go through all that. You don't have to do it anyway, sooner or later. You know, I'm not mad at Creality. I think this is a good product. I'm not getting endorsed. I'm not being paid by them. It's free use. I like 3D printing. Thank you.